What's up everyone, Anwar thinks back at it like a jackrabbit and this week I placed a monster order to Magic Madhouse for Pokemon cards. But is it really a monster order? All the bigger YouTubers, they spend well more money. Well no, it's not a monster order compared to the massive YouTubers but hey, I'm a working class guy on a working class budget and I'm bringing you a working class Pokemon collection. So what did I buy? Let me talk you through it right now. I picked up this Alakazam V collection box. Obviously you get the V card inside it, you get the jumbo V card inside it, you get four packs of Pokemon cards too. I believe it's two Vivid Voltage and then two other random ones. I also picked up this Zygrade pin collection box. Now, I know what a lot of you are thinking, this box is about four years old, why did I buy it? Well. The simple answer is, I was out of the Pokemon game for the past four years, well, to be precise, since about 2003, actually. And in all that time, there's a lot of cards that I missed out on, so even though some of the packs in here aren't worth as much to the regular collector, they are worth it to me because I've already missed out on them, and opening them now is quite interesting for me, so that's why I picked up this Zygrade box. Next up was the full set of five Galar Power Tins. Now, I've opened one of these before from Asda. If you want to see that video, you can go check it out. And when I did, I called this a Farfetch'd. I know now it's not a Farfetch'd and it's a Surfetch'd, but that's the beauty of this channel. I'm not one of these YouTubers who's going to pretend that I know everything, that I know every single Pokemon. I'm going to be completely honest with you. And that's part of the beauty of it, isn't it? You can go back to my first Pokemon video on this channel when I opened the Vivid Voltage and I didn't know most of the Pokemon in there to now where I know a few more. But these boxes are great though. It's also got, I believe, a Rapid Ash on the outside. Please collect me if... Please collect me if I'm wrong. Adam, get your mind right. Please correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is an Alolan Rapid Ash maybe. In each one of these five tins, you get two packs. You get a special card of the Pokemon who's on the tin. It's not a TCG card, it's just a random Pokemon card. And you also get two packs. If I didn't say that before, did you say that before? You might have said that before. Either way, you get two packs, that card, and you get a chip, which that's the thing that you can hear rattling around. I picked up two random blister packs as well. There's this Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion, which has a Delmise on the front and a chip. And you've also got this Sword and Shield base set, which has got a chip and a Gossip Fleur. And finally, I picked up this Sun and Moon Guardians Rising booster pack. Oh, and before I forget, Magic Madhouse do a 5% student discount. So if you're a student or nudge nudge, Wink, wink, you know someone who's a student, you may be able to get a 5% student discount off your next order and every order going forward while they still do it. What I'm going to do is open all these items in separate YouTube videos. So if you want to see that, hit the subscribe button down below, ring that bell. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a video and you can keep up with everything that's going on in the channel. The reason that I'm opening them all in separate videos is so that you can kind of pick and choose when you want to watch them or if there's a certain set that you don't want to see open. Maybe you don't want to see the Galar Power Tins. Maybe you don't want to see this Zygrade box because it's so old. You can kind of skip those videos this way. You can also take it at your own pace as well. So you might just want to watch one video at a time. You don't want to watch a big long 40 minute video where I trudge through all these cards one by one. And if you do want to watch it that way, fantastic. All the videos will be there for you. You can just watch them one by one by one. And the benefit for me is I get to take my time with every single one of these packs. That way you get the better experience from me where I can talk about them all properly. I don't need to rush them thinking about what's next, what's next. I need to open them all, people are waiting. I can just do it in my own leisurely time and we can all enjoy it together. But I'm not just going to leave you like that. Of course I'm going to open something today. So let's open these two blisters and this booster of these three random sets. Right, so let's start with this Sword and Shield and then work our way backwards through time. And this is kind of the, the set that came along with the boom of Pokemon, isn't it? Like this is where Pokemon's really started to boom. We've got a cold card in there. We have got the Gossy Fleur. A little gossip through there, see how it shines, how beautiful it is. Look at that, absolutely beautiful. You yeah, having that one, Shaolin Pete? So, gossip to start off with, 
and then let's crack the chip out of it while we're at it there is your chip now here's your pack so we're opening this pack first sword and shield let's rub it for luck let's rub it for luck come on so let's turn away just in case the cord card is like backwards or whatever let's uh, not even look at it one two three four <sighs> come on baby let's do this right water energy to start with a feral form oh okay raboot a booting rabbit like a rabbit's gonna boot you okay lumberry okay snom mawile <laughs> so we got this gossifleur hollow in like on the outside then inside we got a regular gossifleur how was that for uh omens for you a goldine yes op i love it you love it a diggler is this the reverse it is the reverse is a nicky and in the back is a op cloister i love it you love it not quite a holographic but okay it'll do right what do we go for next do we go for sun and moon crimson invasion or do we go for sun and moon guardians rising hmm i think i'll go crimson invasion let's pop this bad boy open so oh don't you hate it when it does that it just comes off and then this bat just stays on you gotta dig your nails in and scratch it all out and all that stuff it's just not it's not a good cricket is it all right rip it there get your fingers inside here we go you've got a cold card inside it let's get rid of this cold card Pokemon inside is this Del Mies Holographic. Looking all lovely and beautiful. Thank you very much. One, two, three, four. Let's get it. Electric Energy. Devoured Field. Oh, we've got, we got an invasion from Nickit there. An Alolan Gravla. OP, I love it, you love it. Chinchino. A Corfish. A Pump Kabu. Salandits. A Feebas. OP Cubone, I love it, you love it. The reverse is. Wow. Type null. Is that a mistake? That's not a Pokemon, is it? Type null? That is surely a mistake card, isn't it? Like, I've never heard of type null in my life. That's That's got to be an error card. Misprint. I'm going to look into that one. I'm going to look into that one. And then in the back oh i thought we were gonna get something good i'm still looking at this type null what is this type null i don't i don't get it like i'm gonna have to look into that one in the back is a camera which again not a holographic it's not an old piece, so I don't love it. You don't love it. And uh, yeah, okay. Final pack. Here we go. Sun and Moon Guardians Rising. Let's break this open and see what delights are inside. All right. Electric energy to kick off this final pack of the video. Sabalai. Okay. A Marini. Enhanced Hammer, Groomy, Whalemer, Beldum, Rock Rough, Machop, 
Oh, look at that. Two rock roughs in the same pack. It's a reverse. And in the back, oh, yes, we've got a holographic. We've got a pull. It's a Musdale. Ka ching Let's see the value pop up around here somewhere in the video. Good editing, lad. And uh, here we go. We've got the Mudsdale. Mudsdale reverse. So out of all those three packs, the only interesting thing was, was this type null. Is that a printing error? you have to get at me in the comments. I'll have a look into that. And a Mudsdale hollow. That's it. That's the video. Thank you very, very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this, please hit the subscribe button and ding that bell down below because I'm going to be coming back on a regular basis, giving you all hints and tips on how to get Pokemon, where to get them, how to get good deals and stuff like that, and what's good value for money in the UK. If you're British watching this and you want to know where the best places are, value for money Pokemon, where to get deals like the student discount I told you about earlier, hit that subscribe button, hit that dingy bell, and I'll help you out as much as possible. Also, please drop your comment down below. And let me know what your favourite pull of mine was in this video. Hit the like button. And with that, I am out. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you soon with more content.